good evening friends today i am going to show about dominance method dominance method is such that the row value that is here it is a a will try to retain the maximum value at the end of the problem and b will try to retain the minimum value at the end of the problem in we have a shortcut here to apply to do the dominance method i am writing the same question again here Twenty, fifteen, twelve, thirty-five, twenty-five, fourteen, eight, ten, minus five, four, eleven, zero. Now what I am going to do is find a total of each row and each column. The total of this row, that is A one, will be twenty plus fifteen plus twelve. Plus thirty five. That is nothing but eighty two. The total value of A two will be twenty five plus fourteen plus eight plus ten. That will be fifty seven. The value of A three will be minus five plus four plus eleven plus zero. That will be ten. And the value of column that is B one. Twenty plus twenty-five minus five will give you forty. The value of B two, fifteen plus fourteen plus four will give thirty-three. The value of B three, that is twelve plus eight plus eleven, will give thirty-one. And the value of B four will be thirty-five plus ten plus zero, that is forty-five. Now a As I told first, the A that is row will try re, try to retain the maximum value till the at the end of the answer. According to that, here the minimum value we are going to strike out first, as to retain the maximum value at the end of the answer. So here the least value in the row is ten. So uh, what I am going to do is. I'm just going to strike this row. Now, after A's turn, next it is B's turn here. B should cancel out the largest number first. Has to retain the least number at the end of the answer. That is here the largest uh, sum of the column is forty-five. So, I'm going to strike out this column. Now it is A turn again. Next, A will try to cancel this particular row. Has to retain the maximum value. Now it is B turn, and B will now cancel the largest value, largest column. That is here forty. now it is a turn again but here there is no other row left other than this we can't cancel this now so next it is b turn now here b we will see which is the largest value that is 33 now i am going to cancel this particular column now it is a turn and no other row is left and this is the final value of this problem value of game is 12 thus here it is a1 and here it is b3 Resu the value resulting to a1 and b3 is 12 and it is not cancelled till the end thus One comma three, that is nothing but a in eighth row. This is the first row, and in b column, this is the third row. So one comma b column, this is the third column. It is thus it is one comma three, 
and it is known as saddle point. And this is the solution of this game. Th thank you friends for watching it. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.